For decades, rumors have swirled about the United States secretly operating highly classified black triangular craft known as the TR-3A and TR-3B, with some going as far as to claim that these platforms were designed using reverse-engineered alien technology. In fact, in the early 90s, it was even reported that these covered craft flew alongside the F-117 during combat operations over Iraq in Desert Storm. Not only were highly classified stealth aircraft like the F-117 flying for years before the government acknowledged it existed, but even more exotic secret aircraft are now known to have been prowling the skies over the southwestern United States for years. While we're all but certain that name was actually tied to the B-2 Spirit program, there is a fair amount of evidence to suggest that something similar to what people were reporting as the Aurora may have really been in testing. Housed in the same secretive hangars as Boeing's Bird of Prey and other secret platforms already lost to time. According to Aviation Week's unnamed sources, these aircraft may have been deployed to Alaska, Britain, Panama, and Okinawa, as well as flying in concert with the F-117 Nighthawk during combat operations in Iraq to provide laser designation of targets over Baghdad. That claim, while not officially substantiated, might explain why the documents given to Iraqi made pilots to identify the F-117 in the air also showed the silhouette of the B-2. Confusion over just what was being seen in the skies over Iraq may have prompted them to include the only other black triangle aircraft America was known to fly. However, the B-2 was not in service then, which would raise the question of what they actually saw. Though, admittedly, this line of reasoning may be a bit of a stretch. Popular mechanics discussed the Northrop TR-3A alongside other undisclosed but reportedly sighted aircraft in their coverage including another boomerang-shaped platform said to be completely silent and boasting a massive wingspan that stretched between 600 and 800 feet, or three to four times the size of the B-52 Stratofortress. But this isn't the end of the story for these unusual Black Triangle sightings. In our next installment in this series, we'll explore stories about the TR-3B, a similar Black Triangle that's said to be powered by reverse-engineered alien technology. We'll also look into the real patents that may support these claims. In 1991, America's Black Triangle was seemingly revealed to the world in a series of articles published by Aviation Week and Popular Mechanics. According to Aviation Week, the stealthy aircraft was designed by Northrop, the same firm responsible for the Black Triangular B-2 Spirit, in 1976 alongside Lockheed's Hab Blue efforts that would ultimately produce the F-117. Northrop called its stealthy triangular aircraft the Tactical High Altitude Penetrator, THAP. Boeing's YF-118 Bird of Prey, as just one example, started its design process in 1992 within the secretive confines of the U.S. military's Groom Lake facility, known to most as Area 51, and conducted a total of 40 classified test flights over Nevada between 1996 and 1999. The very alien-looking bird of prey was only disclosed to the public by Boeing in 2002 because the company financed the entire $67 million program without a penny of taxpayer funding. It's been widely reported that other more classified government-funded technology demonstrators will never see similar disclosure, with some even reportedly being buried in the sands of Area 51 to be lost to time. Although defense spending did see consistent reductions following the fall of the Soviet Union, it's worth noting that, until the late 1990s, the United States was still allocating a larger percentage of the nation's GDP to defense than it does today. In fact, when adjusted for inflation, America's 1992 defense budget of $325.03 billion equates to more than $718 billion today meaning Uncle Sam certainly had the money to fund a variety of classified programs. Further, in 1991, it was reported that the U.S. Air Force had devoted more than $60.3 billion to classified research, development, and procurement over the five preceding years. That's the equivalent of nearly $137 billion today, or enough to purchase more than 1,500 F-35 as in today's market. 
If you enjoy content like this, please like and subscribe this video as I appreciate all your support.